Okay, so all of y'all take out your textbooks and turn to page 30, page 30. Okay, I want all of y'all to turn to page 30. So I will read the question. If you don't have your textbooks, it's on the screen that I have shared. Okay, so if you know the answer, you can raise your hand. Okay, the first one. Human body is made up of millions of it. So you have to name the following. Human body is made up of millions of it. Okay, Sadat. Yes. Cell, ma'am. Okay, cell. Okay, or we can say cells. So if you all have a pencil with you, can write it down. Cells, C-E-L-L-S. -L -L okay, cells. Okay, the next one, the process of breathing out is dash. Process of breathing out is dash. Okay, Vaishnavi, yes? Exhalation, ma'am. Exhalation, okay, very good. So, the spelling of exhalation, E, X, H, A, L, a T I O N. Okay. Exhalation. Okay. The next one. The organs that pump blood pumps blood to different parts of our body. The organ that pumps blood to different parts of our body. Okay. Aravi. Aravi or Aravi? I don't know. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Tell me the answer. The organs that pumps blood to different parts of our body. It is the heart, ma'am. Very good. It is the heart. So the spelling of heart is H-E-A-R-T. If you are writing it down, I will repeat again. H-E-A-R-T. Heart. Okay. So the next one. The waste product of our body produced by kidneys. What is the waste product that is produced by the kidneys? Okay. Who wants to answer? Okay, Suvir? Yes, Suvir? Ma'am, it is urine. Very good, it is urine. Okay. Okay, so U, R, I, N, E is urine, the spelling of urine. U-R-I-N-E. Okay, the next one. The addition of harmful and undesirable substances to the air. The addition of harmful and undesirable substances to the air. Okay, Ariana. Yes. Pollution, ma'am. Very good. It is pollution. Okay, so the spelling of pollution, if you're writing it down, P-O-L-L-U-T-I-O-N. Okay, I'll say it again. P-O-L-L-U-T-I-O-N. I O N. Okay. So we'll go on to the next one. You can turn your page to page 31. Okay. Page 31. It says choose the correct option. So the first one this is the main organ for breathing. So here you can just stick your uh, beside the letter. Okay, you can just stick beside. So this is the main organ for breathing. Muscle, stomach, kidney or lungs. Okay, somebody is on unmute. You can mute. Okay, Brindesh. Where did you go? No, don't don't be on mute. Okay, be on mute. Okay, I missed Brindesh. Oh no. Yes, yes, I found it. Okay, yes. Tell me the answer. 
Ma'am, lungs. Very good. It is lungs. Yes, you can mute. Okay. So, the main organ for breathing is lungs. So, you can tick D. Okay. Next one. Which of these organs is not a part of the respiratory system? Windpipe, stomach, nose or lungs? Tell me which one is not part of the respiratory system. Okay. Fuzel, I'm sorry. Is that your name? Yes. Tell no, ma'am. Which one? Nose? No, that's the wrong answer. Okay, you can mute. I'll ask somebody else. Okay, Sage. You can mute. Yeah. Stomach. Very good. It is stomach. So, stomach is one of the organs that is not involved in our respiratory system. Okay, the next one. The process of breaking down food into simpler substances is uh, inhalation, exhalation, excretion or digestion? Which is the right answer? Okay. Catherine? Who did I unmute by mistake? Okay. Sanaya? I'm sorry. I'll ask Catherine. Okay. Yes. Yes, Catherine. Digestion. Digestion. Okay, very good. So, digestion is the process of breaking down food into simpler substance. So, you can take digestion. Okay, the next question. How many bones are there in our body? How many bones are there in our body? 100, 200, 206, 106. Okay, Janmesh. 206. Very good. 206. Okay. You can mute. Okay. Next one. We breathe in air through this organ. We breathe in air through this organ. Nose, heart, kidney or brain. So tell me which organ. Okay. Anika, I don't know if that's your name. What's your name? Anika. Okay, Anika, tell me. Nose. Nose, very good. So, nose is the organ that we breathe in air. Okay. So, we are going on to the next one. Write true or false for the false statements. Okay, correct or wrong. So, you have to tell me if it's true or false. Okay, the first one. The brain sends messages to different parts of the body. Is it true or is it false? The brain sends messages to different parts of the body. True or false? Okay. Uh, Sanaya? Yes. True, ma'am. Very good. It is true. So, the brain does send messages to different parts of our body. Okay. The next one. The process of breathing in is called inhalation. Is it true or is it false? Somebody who hasn't answered can raise your hand. Okay, v Vivan? Yes. Ma'am, true ma'am. Very good, it is true. Okay, you can mute. Okay, so the process of breathing in is called inhalation. You can just write T there, no problem. Okay, now the kidneys filter blood and produce air. Is it true or is it false? Okay, Nathan. Yes. Uh -huh. Tell me the answer. Kidneys filter blood and produce air. Is it true or false? It's false. Okay, what's the right answer? What does the kidney produce? It produces urine. Very good. It produces urine. Okay. So, you can write false there and you can just underline air and write the correct answer urine. So, U R I N E. Okay. 
Again, you can underline air and you can write urine. U R I N E. Okay. The air we breathe in passes through our nose, windpipe, and lungs. Again, I will read. The air we breathe in passes through our nose, windpipe, and lungs. Is it true or false? Okay, Arushi. Yes. True, ma'am. Yes, it is true. Very good. Okay. The next one. Heart helps us to think. Heart helps us to think. Okay, Avani. Yes. The last one. Heart helps us to think. False. Okay, what's the right answer? Brain helps us to think. Thing. Very good. Okay, you can mute. So, the brain helps us to think. So, you can underline heart and you can write brain above it. You can write brain. B R A I N. Brain. So, you can write brain above that. Okay. Now, we're moving on to choose the correct option to fill in the blank. So, here you can just tick the option. Okay, no problem. You don't have to write it. Okay, we eat food through our dash, nose or mouth. We eat food through our dash, nose or mouth. Okay, uh, Samarth. Yes, yes. You can tell me the answer. We eat food. mouth. Okay, very good. We eat food through our mouth. Okay, good. Okay, the next one, the dash, kidney or heart is located in our abdomen. The, da the dash, kidney or heart is located in our abdomen. Okay, I don't know if it is Chelsea or Delicia, one of y'all can answer. Yeah. Unmute and answer. Yes. Ma'am, kidney. Very good. Ma'am, kidney. Okay. Okay, the kidney is located in our, oh, sorry. Okay, don't unmute. Okay. Okay, the next one, third one, dash, urine or air is the waste product of our body. Dash, urine or air is the waste product of our body. Nihira, do you want to answer? Yes. Yes, ma'am. Urine, ma'am. Very good. Urine. So, yes, very good. So, urine is the waste product that is produced from our body. Okay. So, food from the stomach reaches our dash. So, from the stomach, the food reaches the heart or the intestine. Tell me which is the right answer. Okay, J Joshua. Intestines, ma'am. Very good. Intestines. Okay. So, you can mute. So, food from the stomach reaches our intestine. So, you can take intestine above. Okay. The next one. Burning of garbage and wood leads to dash. Burning of garbage and wood leads to dash. Air or water pollution. Air or water. One minute. Okay. So tell me. Air or water. Okay. Ronan, you want to answer? Yes. Air pollution, ma'am. Okay. Very good. Air pollution. Yes. You can mute. Okay. So now we're moving on to match the following. So you can tell me. Like, say, the first one says smoke. So, you can tell me the option. Either it's A, B, C, D, or E. Okay? So, you can tell me which is the right one. So, first one is smoke. So, tell me which is the right answer. Okay, Samra? Yes, Samra. Air pollution, ma'am. Very good. It is air pollution. Okay, you can mute. So, beside C, you can write the number 1. So, beside C, you can write 
one. Okay, the next one, tissue. Tell me which one, which is the right answer for tissue. Luke, you want to answer? Okay. Yes. Uh, Ma'am, the right answer for tissue is uh, made up of cells. Very good. So, made up of cells. Okay. So, beside D, you can write 2. Beside D, you can write 2. Okay. Next one, lungs. The next one is lungs. So, tell me what's the right answer. Okay, Sanket? Yes? Ma'am, chest cavity, ma'am. Very good. Chest cavity. So, beside A, you can write 3. You can mute. Beside A, you can write 3. Okay. The next one, kidney. Next one is kidney. So, tell me which is the right answer. Okay, Azad? Yes. Pro pro process urine. Produces urine. Repeat. Produces, produces urine. Okay, very good. Okay, so produces urine. So, beside E, you can write 4. Beside E, write 4. Okay, the last one, skeleton. The last one is skeleton. So tell me which is the right answer. Okay, Tejas? Yes? Bones. Very good, bones. So beside B, you can write five. Beside B, write five. Okay? So, we have finished all the questions behind the textbook. Now, we will read the textbook. Okay? So, you can all come back to page 30. Come back to page 30. Okay? Okay. So, let's start from air pollution. So, who wants to read, you can raise your hand if you want to read. Okay, I want to give somebody who hasn't answered a chance. Okay, Bindushri, yes, you can read. All of you, make sure you're following. Yes, yes, you can read. Air, air pollution. Pollution is the addition of harmful substances into our environment. Environment. Environment making it dirty and unsafe for plants, animals, and human beings. The harmful substances that get added to the environment pollutants. are called pollutants. Okay, very good. Thank you. Okay. Okay, now we can go to the next. Oh, are you still on unmute? Okay, no problem. So there's a small sentence here. When these harmful and undesirable substances are added to the air as a result of different human activities, it is called air pollution. So, different human activities can be through vehicles or factories. So, this causes air pollution. Okay, I want somebody to read causes of air pollution. Somebody hasn't got a chance to answer? So, you can read. Okay, Elijah? Yes. Yes, Elijah, you can you can unmute and read. Yes. Causes of air pollution. The following are some of causes of air pollution. Smoke as well as harmful gas con containing, containing practicals of dust and heavy Materials. Metals. 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 Mm. Released. 
released by industries industries and facts factories household gas has articles and release from vehicle more release due to burn soil waste such as garbage rubber tires crack crackers and woods okay thank you okay so now i want somebody to read harmful effects of pollution okay suhani yes harmful effects of air pollution air pollution has several harmful effects on living as well as non living things it can lead to respiratory diseases such as asthma and lung cancer it's asthma it can cause okay okay continue it can cause breathing problems coughing diseases dizziness 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 okay dizziness children pulse. means you feel you know you your head is you know you can't stay stable okay you you feel like the whole thing is rotating so that is what you call it as dizziness yes you can continue watering of eyes and ir irritation, irritation in throat and nose okay it can harm plants crops and even mo monuments and buildings okay Ex excessive air excessive air pollution can cause changes in the climatic conditions climatic. throughout the world climatic conditions throughout the world okay thank you i want somebody to read reducing air pollution somebody hasn't got a chance today okay devyanshi yes yes ma'am air pollution can be reduced in the following ways plant more trees also take care of the plants and trees already present in your neighborhood Okay. Avoid burning any waste products. Always dispose garbage in a responsible manner. Use bicycles or public transport as much as possible. Also use non-polluting fuels in your vehicles and get them checked regularly. Okay, very good. So this is what we learnt in the chapter human body. So we have learnt. the from the beginning from the internal organs all the way going up to the respiratory system and what can cause problems that is air pollution can cause problems for our respiratory system and how it pollutes the air so i'm going to read the wrap up part okay so i want all of y'all to keep a finger and make sure you are following and you can understand okay from the beginning what we've learned from the beginning our body is made up of cells tissues organs and organ systems the human body is made up of organs that have special functions organs that can be seen with our eyes are called external organs organs that are located inside our body and can't be seen with our eyes are called internal organs the brain is located inside the head and is protected by the skull it helps us to think kidneys filter the blood and remove waste from from it in the form of urine bones give shape to our body there are 206 bones in our body that form the skeleton the nose windpipe and lungs are organs 
that form the respiratory system. Breathing in is called inhalation and breathing out is called exhalation. Deep breathing is a simple process which ensures that oxygen is taken in during inhalation. The addition of harmful and undesirable substances to air as a result of different human activities is called air pollution. So we have finished the lesson. This was just a wrap up. So all what we have studied from the beginning till the end, that is still air pollution, they have made it into points and they have given us so that we can remember. Okay, so that is all. We have finished the class. So I want to tell you all that I have sent the PDF, isn't it? I've sent the PDF. So make sure you write the PDF. You can take your time. Make sure you're learning the spellings. If you don't know the spellings, you can write it two, three times. Not a problem. And make sure you're learning. You can watch the offline videos. You can download it from Campus Care and watch it anytime you have a doubt. Okay. So that is all. We end our chapter here. So this is about the human body. So now if you have any doubt, you can ask me. You can raise your hand. If you want to ask me any doubt, okay, I, yes, Arushi, yes, you want to tell me something? Ma'am, the excretory system, what are the organs of it? Okay, so the excretory system just involves the kidney and then it involves the small intestine and large intestine. But because it's not there in your textbook, we have not touched that part, okay? So they've just touched on uh, respiratory system. So we will only stick to respiratory system, okay? Okay, so we have a few more minutes. If somebody else wants to ask me a question, you can ask me. Okay, Shishira, yes? Ma'am? Yes. Ma'am, can you hear me? Ma'am, yes. ma we just finished only page number 30 and page number 31 exercises. You didn't finish page number 32 and page number 33 and page number 34 exercises. Okay, I will tell you why. That's because now for your online exam, you only have to choose answers, isn't it? Yes or no? Yeah, ma yes. yes ma that is why we concentrated only on those type of questions. If you were in school, you had to write, isn't it? You had to write short answers and all. But because mm -hmm. we are doing online classes and when you appear for your exams, you will just have to click the options. So that is why we only did those type of questions where you can only just tick or, you know, click the correct answer. That's why I haven't done the other parts okay don't worry okay, whatever no. we are doing in all these choose the correct true or false all of that the same thing is again on the short answers and all of that you have to just write two or three more lines that's all okay but since again i'm repeating it's online and you just have to choose the click the answers or whatever so that is why we only stick to all these type of questions okay can I get a thumbs up if you understood this? Okay. Okay. So I can ask one more person if you want to ask me a question. One more person. Okay. Nihira. Yes. What happened? Yeah. Ma'am, um, what is a cell made up of? A cell is made up of... A cell is the smallest unit of our body. Okay, you can't say the cell is made up of anything because we are made up of that. Okay, that's how God has created us. But I can tell you from the cell, the cells are made up of, they are made millions. Okay, so all these millions of cells, they join together and that's how they form the organs. So they join together, they are called as tissues and these tissues form into organs. So all the organs that are present on the inside are made up of millions of cells. Okay. 
so we always say that cell is the smallest unit of our body okay so that's yes, ma'am okay so we have very less time so we finish the class so thank you so much for joining me and you can always you know see the videos write your pdfs and you can write your pdfs very slowly you don't have to do it in a hurry make sure you're learning for your exams we don't know when the exams are but make sure you learn okay thank you so much for joining me children bye 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 ma'am bye ma'am thank you ma'am and good morning ma'am bye ma'am thank you